Valparaiso, I'm meteorologist Lauren Hilko here with a look at your Storm Shield weather update. Right now, Valpo is currently very chilly, and if you haven't heard, classes are canceled today and for the day tomorrow. And the reason is, is this wind chill, and these wind chill values are going to be very low over the next couple of days. Valpo is currently under a wind chill warning. We can expect um, some very, very, very dangerously chilly temperatures. Um, this includes the counties of Jasper, Lake Newton, and Porter counties, and this will be in effect until Wednesday at 9 a.m. And we even have a wind chill watch that is issued out to our east. So you may be wondering, what are temperatures looking like around the region? Right now, negative 4 degrees by 2 p.m. on Wednesday, and the temperatures are slowly just going to start to plummet. Negative 21 degrees by 6.30 a.m. on Tuesday, and this isn't even factoring in the wind chill yet. Negative 34 in Green Bay and negative 38 in Minneapolis. And those... Um, temperatures are just going to stay very chilly. Negative one degrees will be the high temperature we see on Tuesday at 4 p.m., only getting up to negative 13 degrees in Green Bay and negative 16 degrees in Minneapolis. And those temperatures are still going to be very chilly. By Wednesday at 6 a.m., we can expect a temperature of negative nine degrees. So you may be wondering with the Wind chill in the forecast, how low can these temperatures get? We can expect to see a temperature of negative 43 degrees with the wind chill um, on Tuesday at 6 a.m., negative 20 or negative 66 in Green Bay and negative 61 in Minneapolis with that wind chill. So with the wind um, and the very cold temperatures, it's going to be very life-threatening out there. Negative 30 will be the wind chill uh, by midnight on Wednesday, and that temperature won't get any better. Negative 27 will be the wind chill at 6 a.m. on Wednesday. So over the last couple of days, we've used the term wind chill a lot, and especially in the forecast for today. So you may be wondering, what is wind chill? Well, wind chill is the temperature it feels like outside based on the heat lost from exposed skin caused by the wind and cold. This is directly off of the National Weather Service website. And with these dangerously conditions, we have been issued under a wind chill warning. And this is issued when temperatures are life-threatening. So make sure if you do have to go out over the next couple of days that you bundle up, make sure and wear a hat because 40% of your body heat is lost through your head. Make sure to have gloves. And if you have any pets outside, please bring them in um, and make sure that they are kept inside until these cold conditions go away um, because hypothermia and frostbite and temperatures with wind chills this low can set in in about five to five minutes or less. So make sure you definitely stay warm. And in hour by hour forecast, we can see at 6 a.m. some partly cloudy skies right around one degree. By noon, we can expect mostly cloudy skies with a negative temperature of negative one. And by 6 p.m. when everybody's heading out to the union or you're heading out possibly to the grocery store or coming home from work, we could expect a temperature of negative four degrees. So what is the temperature is going to be like for tonight? We can expect a low of around negative 15 degrees. This isn't even it factoring in the wind chill yet. Well, with that wind out of the west about 5 to 15 miles per hour and occasional gusts up to 25, we can expect a wind chill of right around negative 29 degrees. So make sure and limit your activity outside tonight. For tomorrow, temperatures aren't going to be improving very much. We can expect a high of zero degrees with mostly sunny skies, but don't let the sunshine fool you because temperatures are still going to stay very, very chilly with a uh, west wind at about 5 to 15 miles per hour and occasional gusts up to 20. Now for the five-day forecast, the temperatures are slowly going to be starting to rise a little bit um, on the day uh, Wednesday. We can expect um, some sunny skies with a high of 15 degrees, getting up to a high of 26, very different than what we've been seeing recently with sunny skies. And by the day on Friday, we could expect some snow on the forecast, but the temperature will slowly start to drop, getting up to a high of 18 degrees. So make sure even though the classes are canceled, if you have to head out over the next couple of days to get some food in the union or you're heading to the grocery store, make sure and bundle up and limit your time outside because it is going to be very frigid. This has been your Storm Shield weather update. I'm meteorologist Lauren Hilko. Thanks for watching.